They should have known I'd be a singer. I mean, the signs were there from the start. I took voice, piano, dance, guitar, cheered, and even acted. But after thinking about what made me happy, I realized what I really wanted to do was sing. So I did as much singing as I could at church, recitals, university, children's choir, girls' rock camp, and more voice lessons. But there were obstacles along the way. My mom was left disabled because of a car accident when I was only three. From second through eighth grade, I endured bullying in part because of being an overachiever and going through a chunky base. During that time, I relied on teacher and parental support, along with music. When people ask about my dreams, I say I want to make music, but during that low point in my life, I like to think music made me. The bullying sparked the songwriter in me and started the musical fire inside. It made me more resilient and more determined to succeed. My experience being bullied compelled me to try to help others by combating bullies through the Anti-Defamation League's No Place for Hate anti-bullying program and Read for Respect. Along the way of life, I continued to prioritize academics, sing and perform whenever I could, participate in theater, and study music. In 2015, I attended a summer camp at Berklee College of Music in Boston. From the first day I checked in, I knew that was where I would follow my dreams of being a professional musician. Berklee offers a professional music major, an education in production, vocal performance, and songwriting. I volunteer in nursing homes, most recently working under a music therapist in the memory care unit, and love seeing the gift of recognition through music, so I'll minor in music therapy. Berkeley requires hard work, sacrifice, and lots of student loans, but I know it's worth it, and of course I continue to pray for scholarships. Until I moved to Boston in August, I continued to study voice and piano along with songwriting. Oh, and that's me playing in the background, by the way. My original song, Caged Bird, was recently copywritten, one of many I hope you'll end up hearing as I follow my dream of being a professional singer, rock the airwaves, and continue my volunteer work in music therapy.